good YouTube this is DP and I'm back at it with some anthem news info and update but before we get started don't forget to subscribe rate comment do all that YouTube channel and again you know how that stuff works so now let's get down to the video this is going to be a short video because I know my video tend to be super long because I talk a lot but anyway let's get down to the business so we're talking about the pre-order access for anthem if you want to play anthem you there's a few ways that you can play next month and February let's start with next month so the first thing is that BioWare and EA is basically pushing people to sign up for the origin access if you have Xbox and EA whatever pre VIP pre-order stuff that they have on the website because I don't really follow EA like that I don't even bother with the origin the only reason why I had one was for FIFA but ever since then what 2325 here I never touched it now let's get on to the nitty gritty of the video so first thing first the open beta for Anthem as we all know is on February 1st through the 3rd which is kind of surprising I thought the beta was going to be for a week or so I remember doing a video about it where Mark Derrick confirmed on Twitter that it was supposed to be about a week or two. Now it's actually three days? It's kind of short for a better, don't you think? Maybe they're doing it because of everything that we already have and what we already seen for the game, but it's a kind of like a short time. Usually a better Destiny better was a week. Well, was like a week? Yes, Destiny better was a week, I think. And the Division better was a week, I believe so. And this one is three days? So I, I want to say the reason I did maybe dividing the beta is because they having one on February, on January and February. So they are probably cutting that in half instead of giving us just those six days. They just like cutting it in half to where we can play on January and you can play on February, just to like spread people out and for them to have more people signing up to the premium access origin and. EA website and stuff like that. The next way you can also play Anthem is if you are a VIP, like a VIP demo for EA. By doing that, best the VIP is on January 25th through January 27th of next year. So next month, that's when if you want to play, you have to go in a EA website and I guess sign up from there or something like that I don't even know if you can do it on the PlayStation or not but I think I'm gonna go ahead and test it out on my PlayStation to see if I can actually sign up and I'm gonna read the description if I do get the Legion of Dawn edition am I do I have access to the VIP demo for January 1st because I wanna I would love to play on January 1st if I do indeed pre-order the game but it doesn't look like it so far. I'm gonna maybe ask Mark Garrett on Twitter and see what he tells me. Now, where to get it, to get both, if you wanna play both of them, is simple. You pre-order the game, Anthem. You subscribe to EA Access or get the EA VIP for both demos. So if you just get the EA Access, I'm guessing you only play the demo for February. But if you get the EA VIP Origin Access, then you get to play both demo for January and February. Which is kind of shitty move, in my opinion. That's, that's a really kind of tricky move to trick people into signing up for the EA website and the VIP bullshit. So I don't really like the tactic. I don't really like the fact that they're doing shit like this. But hey, I mean, what can you do? You know, they're like kind of driving the hype. They gave us the alpha just to kind of like push people into getting the pre-order. That's what I believe. That's my opinion. I think the alpha was just for the purpose of pushing people and then boosting the sale. And now they have this VIP demo thing that they're throwing around everyone on Twitter, every Anthem news places you can think about just to let people know hey you want to play on february because january just came out of nowhere nobody was expecting that we knew february was the scheduled date for it, the release and for the better but now they say oh you want to play the demo before everybody else will just get a uh, ea origin access then boom you get it on january 25th i don't i don't like that move but I, what else can you do so i'm gonna again i'm gonna go try it on a on the PlayStation and see if it works then I will let you guys know probably over on Twitter or maybe I make a one minute video and just to let you know hey if you wanna 
get get it you can go through playstation blah 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 but because xbox user you guys are probably gonna get it easy so that's not the problem all right now let's go uh yeah about speaking of xbox i think you guys also going to have access to the the game like a week before he releases right like the early access to or the full game if you a subscriber if you're a member of uh, ea access i believe so uh, for us playstation we have to wait on the 22nd but for you guys you will get like a week or 24 hour early i'm, I'm gonna have to go back on twitter and then kind of like go through my micro gamble and mark Derrick uh tweet and just kind of pick that up if i can because i know right now probably like millions but anyway guys i'm gonna just end the video right here just wanted to update you guys on this issue and if you want to play the game that's how you do it so hey go out there and do what you gotta do to get the game because the game is pretty good it's looking super promising and i can i'm telling you you're not gonna be disappointed maybe you will don't take my words for it all right peace out